Lights on Abama and Wrestle Universe, we kick off the N1 Victory 2023. This is Pro Wrestling Victory! 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 でも誰が勝つのかわからないでも誰が勝っても面白い。でも、でも。8月6日、アベマプレゼンツ、N1ビクトリー2023全対戦カード。第1試合、スタリオンロジャース、吉岡聖輝、感動修順バーサス。正輔良平安村ゆり第2試合、N1ビクトリー2023、B-ブロック公式戦、ソヤンマナブVSジャック・モリソン。第3試合、A-ブロック公式戦、イラムライヨシキVSジャック・モリソン。第4試合、リーブロック公式戦安西優馬バーサスランスアロアイ第5試合エムロック公式戦吉岡優希バーサス正木富美男第6試合宮脇潤太天草藤田和幸バーサス弘樹加藤家敦丸藤直光 第7試合、B-ブロック公式戦、イラバ・ダイキン・バーサス、イホデ・ザクソル・ワグナー・ジュニア。第8試合、A-ブロック公式戦、アダム・ブルックス・バーサス・キュンワー。セミファイナル、B
Shuji Kondo, Seki Yoshioka and Stallion Rogers already in the ring, waiting to get their hands on GLG, trying to make these good-looking guys less good-looking than they already are. They got the work cut out for them though. Anthony Green is an absolute stud. Anthony Green putting the green in the green. Yohei and Tadasuke, former GHC Junior Heavyweight Tag Team Champions together. And I have a feeling they're going to be chasing after that again before the end of the year, Mark. Yeah, absolutely, Stu. Next week, in fact, Tadasuke and Yohei will be facing Kondo and Yoshioka, 9th of August, Crocken Hall, in round one of our tournament to crown the next challengers for the GHC Junior as Heavyweight Tag Team titles. As much as I love Yohei and Tadasuke, Seiki Yoshioka and Shuji Kondo are a frightening tag that's, team That's exactly the word I was going to use, yeah. I Great mean, dynamic. Have, yeah, they have everything. They have that balance together, you know, that everything that the other one doesn't yep. have. Yep. Perfect combination. Yep. Really, really complement each other. And they've got experience of teaming together in Wrestle 1 as well. Very effective partnership. Boom. There's the bell. We are off. Shuji Kondo in no rush to get his hands. Oh, he's just threatening Tadasuke on the outside there. Getting him to flinch. This man could make Chuck Norris flinch. <laughs> yeah, he's an absolute weapon, isn't he? He is. Yohei's going to have to keep away from him. Yeah. That's what you've got to do. Or else that's going to happen. He's the bulldozer of the junior heavyweight division, Shuji Kondo. Yeah, I mean, I've seen this guy deal with heavyweights with ease. Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> Oh, here we go. This yeah. is what they need to do. Tarasuke and Yohei taking on the big man. Two on one from GLG. Here comes Yoshioka, though. We've gone from the most powerful junior heavyweight to the quickest. Oh, man. Absolute blur. Oh, they've stopped him in his tracks, though, here. Boom. That'll do it. Numbers in game. Stereo. Good looking guys catching him. Let's go. Condo, right place, right time. There's a tag from Tadasuke, Anthony Green steps in. Green had a stint in wrestling stateside in June and July this year. Mostly singles matches, I have to add. Uh, we saw him on fire back in Korakuen Hall, July 15, with the same GLG configuration as today against Jimmy Yang, Stallion Rogers, and super crazy in a winning effort. Yeah, the alternative proved to be a key part of the GLG group. And then one victory last year, Green had it rough. I mean, really, yeah. really rough. In the A block, up against the likes of Masato Tanaka, Goshi Ozaki, Kazuyuki Fujita, Hideki Suzuki, and Keno. I mean, yeah. that's just... That's that, a who's who. Oh, my goodness. Uh, he had his work cut out there. But he did score a win over Wagner. Let's yeah. not forget that. Yeah, absolutely. Now, Green on Yoshioka. <laughs> We have two Yoshiokas on the card today, our very own Noah. That's right. Pro wrestling Noah. Seiki Yoshioka. And then later on today, we have an outsider. Yep. Dragon Yuki. Gate Man, Yuki Yoshioka. Yep. Very, very, very looking forward to seeing him and what he brings to the N1 Victory 2023 this year. Yeah, we've got seven debutants in the N1 this year. We've got All Japan and Dragon Gate represented as well. And the defending champion, Kaito Kimiya, and his fellow finalist, Hideki Suzuki, are not involved in the tournament this year. Yeah, it's quite a different dynamic from last year's yeah. N1 victory. Yeah, it's really wide open this year. Bit of a generational shift as well in terms of the lineup. What time is it? <laughs> it's six o'clock. Look at control the poise. Down he goes, Green sends Yoshioka to the canvas, two. Pops his right shoulder up there, Seiki Yoshioka. Stalin Rogers on the outside there, looking very pensive. Yeah, he's chomping at the bit, isn't he, to get a piece of the action. He is, there we go, yeah, he's starting to get a bit more animated now. High knee from Yoshioka then. Yeah, nice escape there, but he's yeah. not completely free of Anthony Green yet. Up and over the top, out the back door, takes a back elbow 
to the face. Oh, here we go with the leg ladder. Yep. Spot on from Yoshioka. Great execution. Now he's got the opening to make the tag. He's got it. Stalin Rogers in. Meets Green in the middle. Whoa. Oh, nobody home there. That was a hard landing, that it German was. suplex. Into the corner goes Green. Oh, TDT into the innovative oh. offense, yeah. Oh. Beautiful. Really smoothly done as well from yeah. Stalin Rogers against his former teammate in America, in fact, in Anthony Green. The Lone Star opening up with a very, very strong sequence here. Open palm strike, drops Green down to one knee, playing possum by the looks of it. Oh! Yeah, up and over. Beautiful comeback from Anthony Green there. Tags in, Tadaske. Picks up where? Green left off, stomps down on the back of Rogers. This is about 10% Tadaske at the moment. He's not even screaming yet. Yeah. Just starting out getting his rhythm. The outcast. Yeah, when he starts talking, when he starts hulking up. Now, should GLG win here today, Mark? The outcast. Tarasky will record his 1,000th wow. victory. Wow, I bet he doesn't even know that. <laughs> I think Suji Kondo will have something to say about that. <laughs> I think he will. He just had something to say to Yohei. Yohei went flying off the apron onto the guardrail. Oh, oh King Kong the back. Back. Blindside Tarasky. And with a the save there, Anthony Green. Two of the masters of the lariat as well in Kondo and Tarasky. Oh, yeah. Oh my word, that super kick. That was a cracking kick. Anthony Green got absolutely crumpled there. Taraski's managed to get back to his feet, but incoming! Oh, there we go! Yohei. Yohei scouted him. Yeah. Dazed him. Taraski's got him up. Kondo kicks out, pushes him into Yohei. Yoshioka with the jawbreaker. Kondo is getting fired up now. He is. This spells danger. Slams him down. Hooks up the legs. Yohei just gets the save. Yoshioka didn't quite stop him. Two on one on the other side now. Oh, hey, nobody home for those. Oh, and he tried to get out, but Kondo immediately picks him up. Oh! Assisted crash driver. I haven't seen that for a while. Yeah. Here comes Kondo. King Kong Lariat! Thunderous. Yoshioka with a knee on the neck of Yohei, keeping him at bay. Shuji Kondo pins Tadasuke, taking the win. Here is your winner. He's a junior heavyweight hitman, isn't he, Kondo? Oh my, what the crash driver, I haven't seen that for a while yeah. now. We, yeah. were talk, we were talking about that Absolutely. recently. It's Absolutely. a beautiful move yeah. and he just executed it perfectly. And it, it was all set up by Kondo. I am really excited to see Yoshioka and Kondo moving forward. I'm yeah. getting goosebumps at the thought of the damage they're going to cause in the junior division. Absolutely. They'll face off with Yohei Tanaski 9th of August next week at Kurokun. Start of the tournament. Crown the next challengers to face Aether, not Aether, sorry, Targa and Chris Ridgeway. That was a bit of a scene at the end there, Taraske completely yep. obli obliterated. Yeah, he's still out, it looks like Taraske. GLG unable to answer anything there. Stallion Rogers towering over the top of them and he still keeps his eyes locked on as he leaves the ring. N1 Victory 2023, our first of two tag matches in the books. A very big congratulations. Shuji Kondo, Seki Yoshioka and Stalin Rogers.
Time for opening match in the N1 victory 2023. The former enforcer in Congo, Manabu Soya, riding a high, coming off a victory in the N1 Rumble yesterday, less than 24 hours ago. Sawyer looking ready to go. The two-time N1 winner, Katsuhiko Nakajima, is incoming. Nakajima has got Manabu Soya in his sights firmly here. What a way to kick off the N1 victory this year, G-Man. Here we go, Mark Pickering. Stand by for action. Absolutely get yourself strapped in here. Bell sounds and we're underway. First match of the N1 victory 2023. Nakajima versus Manabu Soya. Mark Pickering, here we go. Yeah, it's on, isn't it? Nakajima. Wearing some new shorts this time around. Member of Axis, Abu Sawyer, of course, also sporting new ring gear since the disillusion of Congo, June 24th. Former Congo members, you're quite right, Mark Pickering. This is the feeling out process. Yeah. And don't forget yesterday, Mark, yeah. don't forget yesterday, yeah. Manabu Sawyer winning the N1 Rumble. Yeah. Yep, 53 minute battle that was, less than 24 hours ago. How much damage is on the body of both of these men? Here we go, shoots him off. Boot right to the face of Manabu Soya. It's very difficult to appoint a favourite here. Manabu Soya is having the best year of his career. Nakajima coming off arguably the biggest win of his career in that war against Kento Miyahara. You could say it's first blood to Manabu Soya. And that's the power of Manabu Soya right there. Yeah, ferocious competitor. So Defeated earlier this year, Sanada, of course, is now the reigning IWGP World Heavyweight oh, Champion. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah. Nakajima, right out here on the outside by our table. Oh, wait. Look out, Sawyer. Sawyer's building up steam. Keep your eye on Sawyer, look out! Oh my goodness! Manabu Sawyer sent right into the guardrail here. Yeah! And a boot! Wow! That's what Nakajima can do. Turn the contest right around in a heartbeat. Look at the state Sawyer is in right now. And Nakajima, of course, is going to meet him there. He meets every challenge head on. The gates are open, Mark Pickering. Yeah, they literally are. You're right, G-Man. Nakajima wants to make a statement today. He wants to take out Sawyer here in Yokohama. Hey, Mark, why don't you tell the folks at home what, what the scores on the doors can be? The scores on the doors? The scores on the... How much can you get for a pin, a, a submission, a victory, a draw? What, what's the point system here? Yeah, point system, a victory worth two points. And then we will have the winner of A Block meeting the winner of B Block in the final, 3rd of September in Osaka. 
We're going to crown a new champion this year. And nothing, for, no points for a loss. And it's every contest, there's a time limit of 30 minutes. Well, at this rate, it looks like Manabu Sawyer could be getting nil point. Yeah, he's back into the N1 fold this year. It's Manabu Sawyer. He, oh, wow. he missed out on the cut last year. He did feature 2020 and 2021. But he's been absolutely manhandled right now by Katsuhiko Nakajima. This man synonymous with this tournament. When N1 season kicks in, he is the man to fear, Katsuhiko Nakajima. It's, it's the coldness behind the eyes of Nakajima. Yeah, no emotions, no remorse. So he's got a mountain to climb now. Gotta watch out for those kicks that... That was, that was just a little tease kick you just witnessed there. Yeah, the range finder that is from Nakajima. Sawyer back up to a vertical base now. Wow! Hey, we've got chops on the menu here tonight in Yokohama! Oh, rake of the eye from Nakajima. Snap me. Wow! Wow! It was like a gun going off. That shot just echoed around Yokohama Budokan. That's why he's been earmarked by Takeru, one of the best kickboxers in the world, is the man to win it this year. He's been installed as the favourite by his countrymen and fellow KL artist. Wow! Mother of God! Yeah, Sawyer is taking a beating now. A former All Japan World Tag Team Champion with Keno. He's getting in a kick in, Mark Pickering. Yep. He's going to shoe him. Nakajima is acting as the welcoming committee. Sawyer back in the N1 fold. Look how Frank Nakajima mixes up his levels there in Siguri. Sawyer could be wiped out here. Nakajima smells blood now. Look at that. Relentless kicks, not even letting him get back up to a vertical base. And now Nakajima, just little taps, just little taps. Yeah, just to let him know he's there, he's just toying yeah. with Sawyer at this stage now. Oh, wow. You eliminate a vertical base, you eliminate the power of Sawyer. Going to work on that left leg of Manabu Sawyer. Yeah, got when he picks apart the body, there's nobody that does it better. Look at this execution now. STF. Manabu Sawyer in that submission. Look at the eyes of Nakajima. He's almost smiling as well, is Nakajima. That sadistic smile. Loves inflicting pain. There's ice behind those eyes, Mark Pickering. Look yeah. at Sawyer. He Look must... at Sawyer. Look at the struggle, Mark Pickering. Yeah. Nakajima wants to get his N1 campaign up and running here with a statement victory at the expense of Sawyer. You can see that he can see the ropes. We can see the ropes. But can he reach the ropes? Yeah, he's got to bring the body weight yeah. of Nakajima with him, and he's done it. Ref um, referee Skagosi has got to call for a break here. Yeah, a momentary respite at most for Sawyer. Nakajima firmly in control of this bout. Yeah, Nakajima's not going to slow down. He's not going to hold back. We know that. And Nakajima has targeted that left leg of Manabu Sawyer. Irish win. There he goes. Wow. Absolutely launched everything behind that. Manabu Sawyer floors Nakajima. Both men are down, Mark Pickering. Both men are down. Yeah, it's wide open right now. Timely response, wasn't it, from Sawyer? He needs to produce something then. And uh, you've got to think from yesterday yeah. that uh, when Sawyer got on that mic after winning the Rumble, he said winning the, the N1 Rumble wasn't yeah. enough. Yeah. Uh, wait a minute, Sawyer's caught that boot. <laughs> Wallop! Look at Sawyer go to work on Nakajima now. Running Bulldog. He goes to the lateral press. Cover! Two! <laughs> Two count only. Just trying to smother Nakajima now is Sawyer. Front face lock by Sawyer looking for a suplex. Nakajima putting the anchors on. Has he got the power in that left leg? Sawyer's got him up. Bring Buster. Lateral press. Shoulders are down. Two. No. Yeah, there's no trophy for winning yesterday's N1 Rumble. Great psychological advantage coming into today. 
And you've got to think, everybody that was asked who would win that M1 Rumble, nearly everybody said Keno, except one person that said Nakajima. And who picked up Manabu Sawyer? There you go. And here we are, Mark Pickett. Yeah. And here we are, Yokohama Budokan. Oh, wow! Take away the lariat. Back to that left leg again by Nakajima. Yeah, he just tricked Sawyer then. Dragon screw. He faked the shot high, and then he went low, back to the legs of Sawyer. Floored the big man once again. Sawyer's in trouble here, Mark. Yeah, a lot of trouble right now. And look where he is as well, in the corner. Look at Nakajima. He's braced for impact. Big boot to the face. Sawyer's come out of that corner. And a wallop of a kick right to the chest of Sawyer. Yeah, no intention of going for the cover, Nakajima, though. He spotted the camera, it could be time. It's definitely Nakajima time. Where's he going here? <laughs> Foreign territory for Nakajima here. Missile drop kick and a beauty. Yeah, beautiful execution from Katiko Nakajima. Does everything so well, doesn't he? So well versed, all areas of the game. Indeed, and now Nakajima taking his time. He knows Sawyer's in trouble. He's got to break him down a little bit more. I'm only guessing that's going to be the tactic of Nakajima here. Yeah, Sawyer out to derail. Nakajima's bid for a third N1 crown. Nakajima looking for a suplex. Yeah, shaping up for the Saito suplex. Sawyer knows all about that. 12 to 6 elbow by Sawyer. Fireman's carry. Nakajima out of the back door. Frankensteiner. Hey, shoulders are down. Is this it? No. Oh, a kick right to the face. What's up, sorry, away now. Oh, wait a minute. Counted. Nakajima back off. Psycho suplex. Sawyer's back off. Spear. Holy mackerel. Absolutely ferocious action. And this is just our opening contest of the N1 2023. Both men giving it their absolute all here in our opening bag. The Yokohama Budokan is on fire, folks! Absolutely breathless action then. What an exchange. <laughs> Ten minutes gone of a regulation 30 in the N1 tournament. Could this one go the distance, folks? Nakajima is, uh, he is pretty much a bit of an iron man here in pro wrestling, Noah. Did that big 45-minute time limit draw with Keno. And then, of course, Kento Miyahara as well. Yep, he's done 60-minute draws as well with Keno. Time is no barrier for Nakajima. You have to favor the lighter man the longer it goes. Hey, wait, wait look, at, look at Sawyer here. Yeah, so defiant look across his face. Ah, wow! That's a meaty chop, that is, from Sawyer. The long-time enforcer of the Congo group. You can, oh! you can see the adrenaline of Manabu coming into the veins of Manabu. So look at the eyes, Mark Pickering, look yeah, at the eyes. The sweat just ah! bouncing off the chest ah! of both men now. Ah! Ah! Oh, now Sawyer, impervious to that pain as we trade chops and kicks back and forth here at the Yokohama Budokan. No backing down from either man. Double chops now. Wow. Look at the state Nakajima was forced into the corner then by Sawyer. Here comes Sawyer. Ah, drop toe hold. Here it's comes the kick. Turnbuckle. Oh no. Exclamation mark from Nakajima. But Sawyer gets away from the corner. Wow. One Nakajima, more. my goodness. Yeah, one more high left kick to the chest of Sawyer. Referee's checking on Sawyer now. To wave this off at any time if he feels like he can't continue, but he looks good for now. That one floored Sawyer. Oh, wait, look at the eyes again of Nakajima, and look at the eyes of Manabu Sawyer. Nobody's home, Stop. Stop. but Sawyer continuing Stop. to take these kicks of punishment from Nakajima Stop. now. Yeah, he had to block that one, he couldn't do it. Could this be it? Two! No! Sawyer kicks out! What an effort from Manabu Sawyer so far. You can see 
how much he was boosted by that victory in the N1 Rumble yesterday. It featured all 16 N1 competitors. You just saw a little hint, a little pinch of frustration there on the face of Kazuhiko Nakajima. Yeah, but he's ever a professional. He's got plenty more tricks in his arsenal. Oh, right, no. right kick. It's only stumbled, sorry, now he's down. It's like kicking a brick. Nakajima doesn't care how he wins. He'd love a KO finish, of course. A real statement. And what's Nakajima going to do now to put away Manabu Soya? Yeah. It's not unusual for referee to stop the contest involving Nakajima. Oh. No. Wow! Brutal shot to the body from the two-time N1 winner. Oh. Oh. Referee's there asking Soya if he wants to continue. Oh. Crowd chanting Soya now is absolutely no quick in Soya. Oh. This could be it. Oh. No! Look how close the referee was to that three count. He's as game as they come, isn't he, Manabu Soya? And he's having a year to remember so far. Nakajima now. Looking to put away Manabu Soya. Yeah, it looks ominous for the super heavyweight. Hooks the arm. It's the time. No, 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 no. Wait, Soya. Oh, the headbutt. No! My brain hurts just from watching that. Simon's carry into a knee. We haven't seen that from Manabu Sawyer before. Cool, blimey. Massive lariat. Did you see the sweat? He's Did you see the fist of sweat come off the back of Nakajima? And he's shaping up for one more. Here comes Manabu Sawyer. He just cleaned out Nakajima. Here we go, cover two. No. I thought that was it. This isn't over. He's got to go for the cover. One, two, three. He's, He's it done it. Goodness. What a moment for Manabu Soya. Yesterday, he wins the inaugural N1 Rumble. Today, he just derailed the N1 campaign. Katahiko Nakajima. He's the first man up and running this year. Manabu Soya has just bagged two points. Listen to this crowd. This is incredible. He's always had this in him. Now he's finally coming through. Right to the fore of Pro Wrestling Noah. Fantastic opening bout in the end one. And what an upset. Manabu Soya established himself in the early running as the man to beat. Nakajima out on his feet here. My goodness, what a match. But coming up next, folks, we've got a match from Bloke. Yoshiki Inamura versus GLG's Jack Morris. Stay tuned, Grapple fans.
the Man Mountain, similar to Takeshi Rikio back in the day with the sumo background. Yoshiki Nomura is all present and perfect. And as we uh, wait the arrival of Inamura's opponent, Stu Fulton. Yes, indeed. I'm just looking at the face of Yoshiki Inamura because this is a, a make or break tournament for him this year. I mean, he really has to make a big impact on the scene in order to elevate himself up to where he should be, in my opinion. For once, Stu Fulton, I'm going to agree with you on that. It is pretty much a make or break for Inamura. But as this man comes to the ring, sublime every time, Jack Morris. This is a really difficult one for me. This is all oh, we've got to kill in the house. Jack Morris representing the Klansmen. between two worlds here because I absolutely love Yoshiki Nomura is no secret but my fellow Scotsman my fellow countryman Jack Let's Morris sublime every time comes out in the kill rips it off and he's got a new gear check this out let's have some uh, let's have some a bit of decorum here please too Fulton sure Bell sounds well, are underway. At least this is a, for me anyway, this is a happy outcome either way. Whoever wins this, I will be happy. I just, I'm just glad to see these two absolute beasts going at it. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna pass you, Stu, to pick a side. Let's just call the match, eh? <laughs> Here we go. Well, this is Jack Morris' second N1 victory this year. 2022 was a career best for him. This year is shaping up to be even better. You've also, got, I need to take into consideration, Stu. You've got to here. Block A. Who else is in Block A? GLG member, Block A. GHC heavyweight champion, Jake Lee. There's a bit of conflict there. Conflict There's, of interests. Yes, indeed. How this is going to play out, because they're in the same block, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, that is going to be very interesting to see how that unfolds. And we might not really get to grips with how it unfolds until a bit later on this month. Indeed, indeed. <laughs> Meanwhile, Inamora going to work on that left arm of Morris. Jack Morris came into Noah last year as an unknown quantity. Fans were like, who is this guy? Who is he? Then Morris proceeded to show them in his Noah debut straight into the N1 victory 2022 with an opening win over Kaito Kiyomiya in Osaka. Just like that, bang. Yeah, then everybody soon found out who Jack Morris was. Now he's, he's looking positioned to be Look at this position. The top non-Japanese in Noah. Eddie Edwards is the only other foreigner so far to hold the GHC heavyweight championship title. Can Jack be the second and can he do it this year? Time will tell, Stu Fulton. It will, and we were talking about this earlier. Let's not forget Wagner. He also stands a very good chance of beating Jack to the, the goal for that heavyweight Well, they, goal. They've, they've uh, wrestled each other before, Stu. Okay. Don't forget Sendai. What a banger that was for the GHC National Championship. We've Monstrous. got another clean break here. We're gonna, we're gonna get a clean break. Monstrous. Yes, another a second. Oh. Hey, come on now, Stu, have a word. <laughs> Yoshiki Namura. Oh, oh he's, nice. he's looking for he's looking for the submission. He's looking for that submission. Jack just caught him on the way in there, but he's now having to deal with the strength. Huge. Here comes in Amora. There's the shoulder from the big man. He's he's got all the tools. Yoshiki Namura, he's massive, he's athletic, great wrestling skills. He's a huge fan favorite, especially amongst the kids. Um, he really needs to make that big impact this year. True say that, Stu Fulton. He but did open up um, last year very well. You know, we saw some great electricity between him and Kenta in our 2022 New Year Whoa. show. But really, since then, it feels like he's hey, just, whoa. just been a little bit short. Yeah, keep your eye on Morris here, Stu. I, I really take my eyes off Jack Morris when he's in the ring because here we Wait, go. Look, Over look the top out. rope. Oh, wow. 
Nice plancha from the Scot. Inamora's head went between the guardrails, Stu Fulton. Did he get it out? Did we have to call the fire brigade? No, he's out, he's okay. We're good, we're good. Uh, Yoshiki Inamura, singles tournament so far. He was in the Fire Festival 2022. He won the B block, uh, but then he lost to Daisuke Sekimoto in the final. He joined the Fire Festival 2021, finished third place in block A. This is his second N1 victory. He did join 20, uh, uh, 20 B block Stoops, Stoops. N1 victory 2023, but he Stoops, finished out, last. Inamura face first into the post here. And now Morris. He decides it? to go down and join him, sends Look his out. head into the opposite post. Where's Morris going now? No, hey, wait a minute, keep your eye on Morris here, folks. Look Except out. On the second row. Oh, Moon. Moonsault off the second row, onto the outside, straight on top of Inamura. Mother of God. What's that? He's get. Given Rino Matsuki a wristband. Yeah, he's uh, he's just stolen her heart. Stolen something. In a moves in and back in over the apron. Bangs on the apron himself. He's got the crowd behind him here now. Jack Morris makes his way to the top turn buckle on the blue corner. Inamura still dazed. Ah, oh, the massive frog splash to the back of Inamura. Rolls him up. Hooks up the leg. He has a pin, but Inamura kicks out. Well, that was a close one, Sue Fulton. A little bit off topic, but I hear that uh, Yoshiki Inamura's favourite food is fried rice, which I was quite surprised by because I hear that his chango nabe cooking is very, very good. I've, I've never had the pleasure, Stu Fulton. Well, yeah, if somebody his size cooks you food, you know it's going to be good. Um, Inamura's N1 comment coming into this, he's going to show he's the strongest and most passionate wrestler this summer. Mora sent into that red corner. Shoulder blast and an elbow to the lower back of Inamura drops him down. Jack Morris's favorite food, by the way, is Yaki Niku. And his comment coming into the tournament, he is out to eat them up one by one. And he has the biggest meal of the day on his plate with Yoshiki Inamura. Strikes a pose. That's, that's snacking on peanuts right there. You know he snacks on peanuts. That's what does it. There's a random fact for you. He snacks on peanuts. <laughs> elbow drop. All fat, no carbs. There we go. Two. You know we're bleeding from his right elbow. He's obviously taking a nasty tumble on the outside. Jack Morris staying on, giving him no space at all. G man. Indeed, this in ballet, Stu Fulton. Come on, in. Jack Come Morris on. has been wrestling Come smart, on. especially these past couple of days. You know, he, he was runner-up yesterday in the M1 Rumble, but he was, his tactics were very, very smart. Thunderous strike to the back of Inamura there, hooks up the leg, more pressure from the Scott, but still, the big man kicks out. Jack Morris. Keeping his eyes on Inamura here. Trying to pick him up to a vertical base. And backs him into that corner. Jack Morris is on a 68% win rate this year so far. Sublime every time. And he's 55% win rate in singles matches. Winding up for this one. Inamura catches him. Turns him straight over and slams him down. My goodness, Stu Fulton. Yusuke Inamura just tried to kill Jack Morris with the world. What a power slam. Almost sent him into orbit. And look at the face of Inamura. Sucking it up here. That's exactly the comeback he needed there to slow down Morris. Morris though has dragged himself back to his feet, fighting through as we know he can fight through, but all oh, the Inamura into the corner there, picks Morris up. Down he goes with a slam. With authority, here comes the big splash. There's the meatball press. Can Jack Morris get out of this? He does. He had to really kick hard out of that one. Oh, 120 kilograms of Yoshiki Inamura on top of him. You can feel the momentum shifting in the favor of Inamura here, Stu Fulton. 
Well, it's oh. really interesting to hear the crowd go quiet as soon as they see Inamura with the upper hand. Oh yeah, because they know Inamura can wallop someone quite hard. Keep your eye on Morris, Moonsault, oh look at that. Catches the Moonsault, oh, runs him into the corner and down. Running power slam oh, to Inamura once again. And the match continues here. Inamora. He's looking very empowered right now. He's back on his feet. He's thinking of that next move, Stu Fulton. This is where we really have to see Jack Morris dig deep. Here he goes. Winding up, building it up. Off the ropes, here he comes. Oh, he's caught him! Oh, there we go! A spine buster! I felt that on my feet. How about that? A Scottish, this could be it! A Scottish spine buster, G-Man. Slamming him into the girders of the ring. The crowd's starting to get behind both of these men here now. I'm hearing a couple of calls for Inamura. From, what's this now? Hooks one arm. Oh, he's pulling him in for a second. He's looking for his move. If he can nail this, Inamura is going to be in a whole world of trouble. And GLG could score a win. He's too big, he's too strong, Stu Fulton, oh, look at the power! Just deadlifts Morris up. Look at this. Oh, he's even going to deep squat him just for show. Where's he going to put him? He's going to squat him again! Oh, no. This, this time he's thumping his way out. Hooks up the arms. Oh, and he just tosses him into the air. Yokohama Airspace were not even notified. Ten minutes in to this A block matchup Jack Morris versus Yoshiki Inamura. Inamura has got the momentum firmly behind him now. And where is Inamura going, oh, Stu Fulton? No way. No way. Jack Morris gets back to his feet. Oh. That could have got very, very frightening very, very quickly there. High risk, high reward. Yep. What on earth is this now? I wouldn't be surprised if the Emerald Squared Circle gets broken here today, tosses him off. Oh, Jack Morris hurt that knee. He hurt the knee, but he landed on his face. Here comes in. No Shoulder. Look, I told you, I told you, the, the ring just came down in the middle. Yosuke Inamura's presence does to your ego what bullets do to flesh. He's on fire here and he is looking to finish off Morris. Oh, he means business. Yosuke Inamura means business. Oh, he got stopped. The Geki Toss got stopped. Morris in big trouble with that knee. Can this be that stop? Oh, can it not? The match continues here. You know, we're looking seriously dazed here now, G Man. Morris seems to have his second win. What's Morris going to do to put in a more away? He's channeling. The power of the ancestors, the clans folks from uh, hundreds of years going back in Scotland. These shots that Inamora are giving Jack Morris will rattle Morris's ancestors. That one certainly did, almost took his feet away from him. Uses some momentum to step in with that elbow there, but Inamora just needs it up. Whoa, that one's for his great-grandchildren. Big one. Now, Inamora. Uh-oh, keep your eye on. Up on the shoulder. Out the back door, here we go. He's looking for that submission hold again, but Inamura's just too strong in this position. Look at that, very, very difficult. 12 to six elbows on the neck of Inamora. Look at the butcher's grip. Look at the hands of Inamora. Yeah, he's got that S grip firmly in place. Morris is smashing his way in there. Oh, the but fingers, the fingers too, they're broke. The fingers are broken. He's got it. 
He's got, he's got it free, and there we go. This could be it, Stu Fulton. Jack Morris looking to, can he lock the, can Morris lock the fingers? I say he's lock the fingers. He has, he's got it. But he's still not anywhere near finishing this. Inamura is stronger than 10 bears who each possess the power of 10 bears. That's a lot of bears, no, D-Man. Wait, 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 two. Back. Oh, left shoulder up at the last minute. He's still trying to get him down. No, he's trying to get the submission. He's not trying to pin him. He's still got that submission hold applied, but he's on the ground now. Cobra twist. He's cranking it. He's oh, he gets the tab. You're seeing him in a tab too. He's forced to give up. Jack Morris victorious over the big man here. The strong man taken out. Here is your winner, Jack Morris. That was an absolute war. Crikey. Ina Mura tried to break Jack Morris's face, his legs his body and he just this man just seems to be able to dig deeper and deeper every single time g-man true say that Stu fulton well this is the part where we say goodbye to uh, people watching in uh, northern ireland on our uh, english youtube channel and everybody else watching on there thank you for watching get on wrestle universe if you want to catch the rest of this show. Yeah, you do want to join us on the arc for the rest of this show here today. The opening night of the N1 Victory 2023 Pro Wrestling Noah. And of course, we will be continuing with the league and tournament going straight through this month into the final in Osaka on September the 3rd. Jack Morris though, he walks away victorious here today, having come out in his kilt. No less. Well done. Picks up two points. I love you. Well, folks, coming up next, Yuma Anzai versus Lance and Hawaii. Stay tuned, Grapple fans.